Back once again with, with the long haul, episode 28. We got Horde Night coming up. I've been doing some resource gathering overnight. Ran out of wood again, and I figured try and do some more stone gathering for uh, for uh, cobblestone. Uh, no, concrete, not cobblestone. We're beyond that point. And you know, figured can't hurt to have too many resources. Really, can never have too many. I did make some more progress on the Horde base. I do have some, well, another 20 blocks ready for uh, making uh, upgrades. I think we might finally get moved in to it just before the Horde. I hope so. Alright, but I'm just traveling here, yo. I figured we'll just go, we'll just... Uh, I'll stream it for Twitch here, yo. Just do some resource gathering overnight. So, yeah, um, trying to think what I want to do here. Actually, before I decide to go loading up more resources into the forge, I'll, I'll cruise over here for, uh, for, um, going over to, we'll go, uh, we'll, we'll actually just cruise over to the base and show you the progress on it. It should pop into existence here. Usually it's not too bad about rendering stuff in. Yeah, you can see, like, I've gotten more of the walls built up and everything. It's, uh, it's coming along. It really is. I'm checking my stone here. Over 1,700. Which, that should give me a decent bit more cement. I did, like, I was able to kind of upgrade everything for all this and I'm fairly quick, yeah. But I did have, like, one block on that wall that I needed to upgrade. And... We'll just get that. I think that's actually the walls done. I'm completely done. We're out of concrete again. It's like, it ten it, even on rebar frames, it tends to fly through. I tend to fly through it. It's like, um... You know... But yeah, it's a it's a process. It, eventually, I'll have the I'll have the supports put up, yo. But I think it's time to start moving the the rest of the well, moving moving off the cracker book roof. It's it's served its time. It's done a it's done me a good service. But yo. Know, Recently, it's like, you know, got it. I accidentally punched a hole in the ground, and, uh, also, you know, you can see the bathroom's getting destroyed, and, and you can kind of, like, walls are just kind of slowly getting destroyed, but, you know, and I completely forgot to read this in the, in the last episode here on YouTube, but, you know, I figure we'll read this safe, and it'll be kind of, you know, the final hurrah of this thing. Um... Magnum grip and shotgun barrel. Nice to see. We'll just take the paper and everything like that. Uh, come play in fibers. I won't take it. It'll... But yeah. I think it's kind of time to... Kind of... For the last hurrah of this base, it's a... I was... So... I'm not talking about... Like, putting it into a... You know, putting a horde against it. Which, although that would be an interesting idea, it would be... It'd be an interesting idea, but... I think it's just kind of the last... Like, by the last row, I think... It's just finally time to let this base, uh... Well, not even a base, really. Kind of just... Hopefully rest in peace and not have to deal with... All the zombies in the world, but... So yeah, let me just uh, get some stuff moved over and and we'll do that. <laughs> well, YouTube, I it's been a few in-game hours. It's like taking me like half an in-game day, but I'm happy to say that um, well, aside from the air conditioners not being here, the the rooftop of the crackbook is basically being left as 
as it is. It, and aside from like the hatch and everything, do you have some zombies out and hanging or hanging around out here? There, we got old uh, Mikey and his brother. I guess they want to come over and, uh, and congratulate me on moving out and moving off the crack of a base. Which I really appreciate. Come on. You don't need to get all wild. Ah. It took a few trips. Marlo, good to see you. Get out. There we go. Blunt weapon's actually level 50 now. We'll even search these guys just to be absolutely sure. Other loot. Ah, yes, yeah, a sham sandwich for the road. A sham sandwich. Wouldn't be the zombies' uh, parting gift without it. Come here. Go away. Out. Bigger will we can at least uh, clear these guys out. Level 97. And. Nope. Get away. There we go. Uh. Penny, you're hanging out in the back room. But yeah, we got all the, we got most of the stuff inside uh, the, the new base. Did get an airdrop. That's how long it took for me to get the get the airdrop uh, taken care of. It's a it, it's a little unfortunate because you know, I'm just moving the base out. A little moving off that. Of that area, but it's it was just kind of time for me to do it. Let's just put the I'm just putting the weapons back in here. Yeah, I've got the shotgun and the and the one AK part. I got the we got the rocket launchers, the the rocket launcher stuff, which I do have another piece I can actually merge so on the stock. Do have a shotgun, short stock, and barrel. Well, I don't really care about that. I never realized I had them to begin with. But it's no biggie. I just want to put all these in. Make sure I kind of get this all just nice and organized. But um, you can see on my like off to the menu a little bit, off to the side on the like outside the menu a little bit. I do have the some of the stuff uh, looking decent. It's uh, well, I got build a storage boxes going. Um, one second, while I put the sham sandwich away. I do have this, you know, like my resource box. I have an extra one just in case I start having overflow. My weapons box. I got the food and medical box, and then. The explosives box I actually use for <clears throat> keeping uh, trader stuff in. That's nice to see. And then I even got the got an ammunition box with way too much paper. What I'm thinking here for uh, having workbenches or anything like that is we'll throw in we'll throw our forges on our side of the on our side of the old. Uh, um, the workbench, you know, keep those looking nice. What, I'm, what I could do for my campfire is actually... We'll do it in the center here. We'll do the little, nice little... I always like doing this just to make it that much nicer. Oh, I complete. Well, that was silly of me. I forgot to take my... A cooking pot and grill out, but that's okay. We can always uh, we can always do it later. I'm not gonna worry about it tonight though for the horde because it's a it's just one of those um don't really need to worry about it. We'll throw our bed in in there. We'll throw. I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, where was I gonna put my my chemistry stations? But we'll actually. Well, that was a misplace, but I was going to place it in the... Thinking about placing it just next to the cement mixer, or... You know, like, kind of like on this... You know, just in this... In the corner, in this corner, or... 
Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Can still see out those a little bit. A little bit of limited visibility, but I digress. What I'm actually thinking about doing now is after doing some quick little upgrades on these supports here, you know, just just for the sake of it. They're not really going to get damaged. I hope not. But, let's go grab that airdrop, because I do have a little bit of time, so give me a little second in YouTube, and I will see you in a little bit. Okay, YouTube, we're coming up to, uh, we're coming up to the airdrop now. Let's see what we've got in it. Not too far out of town, really. Just hanging out. I'm just kind of hanging out down here, so... Um, we got a couple first aid kits and the schematic for those. Oh, would you look at that, the sniper rifle schematic. I, I'm i pretty sure I bought that from Traitor Wrecked. Like, one of the Traitor Wrecks in this world. But also got Magnum Enforcer. Magnum Enforcer is an uncommon book to find. You really don't see, you don't really see it much anymore. It's like, essential for crafting the Magnum, but... I already, I already got the Magnum schematic, so yeah, it's that's pretty nice to see. And figure we'll go raid this house really quickly. I did forget to take out some junk with the from the mini bike, but it's no worries. It's really no biggie at all. Just check this out really quick. We'll even take the cloth fragments. I'm just trying to kill time before this horde rolls around, and it's a... It's like a little anxious for it, but not too worried. Pistol barrel, we'll take it. And just keep on chopping up the cloth. Check the bathroom really quick, see what it's got. Turd, murky water, and nothing really aside from those. We got jar, we got nothing in the oven. And sometimes the uh, the kitchens can be decent, but a lot of times they got nothing for me. Yeah, just find empty cans everywhere. Uh, we'll check the old basement here. I think it's got a gun safe. Well, at least from the looks of the, the armor door, it does. We'll check out old Charlie boy here in the corner. He really got nothing for me. We'll break into this gun safe really quick. It's, it really doesn't take too long now with steel tools. Makes it like a little cakewalk. Ah! There we go. And he got pistol barrel, shotgun short barrel, shotgun parts, and there's shotgun sawed off barrel. Not bad. Uh, not bad. I'll, I'll just take it for more parts. Some some food and drink, a little bit of painkillers down with it. We also got a zombie. Yep, it's just Bob. Looks like he's injured himself a little bit because of the old cactus. Put him out of his misery. One paper. I'm not even going to take that because it's a... Because that is a slap in the face. We'll scrap that old shotgun sawed off barrel. And down, it's just to me, it's worth more as iron at this point. It's like if it was like a high level part to the sawed off shotgun, maybe I'd take it because it's a you know just nice quality, but nah, we got a good old you know, we're just working through this here. We got the toilet with some more turds, actually, got a cooking pot. That is, a, you know, I'll actually keep that instead of scrapping it because I did, I think I forgot to take out the, uh, I'm pretty sure I took, took out the cooking pot grill and all that. What you got for me? You got, you got a flashlight and hunting rifle barrel. Yeah, that's, that's really, I'd say about it for the house. Really? Spike close schematic after I bought it from... Trailer Rock game. Ah. As I say about this game, it's... This game loves to be a troll. When you're not looking for something, it will... 
It will give it to you. Once you need it, the game immediately it goes, Oh, yeah, you don't need that anymore, so... Right, like, oh, you need this, so... Yeah, we'll just take... We'll take... We won't give it to you. But anyways, YouTube, uh... I was gonna hang out for a while with Twitch before the Horde, and I will catch up with you once the Horde starts up. Well, YouTube it is almost Horde time, once again. I'm just doing a little bit more stuff, you know. We're about to kick this off. Here in about in game for five minutes, so. Just want to get all this stuff at least put away to an extent. And. Here it is, Horde Knight. There we go. Get our shotgun, and we'll. I just need a couple medical supplies really quick. Always uh, handy to have medical supplies on you. Alright, let's see where they're coming from. Yep, garage door is closed up. Oh, I forgot I forgot my blunderbuss. I wanted to use a blunderbuss in this base, and I forgot to get my blunderbuss ready. Whoopsie. Oh, well. Oh, no. Why are you guys... Oh, I designed this base bad. Did I forget that... Did I forget that zombies, uh, go after doors? I think I did. Wow. I think I completely forgot that about this version. They, they like going for doors. Well, I, I was going to use this base, you know, have it be, it was purpose built to take on zombies, but... Well, that went that went completely out the window because they they decided to go beating on my garage doors. Oh, uh, well, that was a little, that was a simple little. We're just gonna. That means I'm gonna have to be a little bit on the prowl for uh, for dogs. I can't believe I forgot this YouTube. I'm so sorry. I just wanted like you a nice functional base for for taking out zombies and well I got that but tech, I'm not saying it can't take on zombies it's just that uh well due to this uh, design choice I I screwed up a little bit and the zombies are even getting stuck in the foundation of the of the other base so it's yeah, this has all gone poorly. Oh, this just sucks. Uh, we got a spider zombie here. Come here. I don't want to have to place... Well, I can't split. Can't split. Ow. Well, oh, boy. Zombies want to... Zombies want to have a little fun with me. These guys are so hard to hit as well, so... Yeah. We'll do a little bit of healing there just to make sure I don't die. I really don't want to do this, so... Oh, boy. Spider Zombie doesn't want to have to take his little look in here for... Come on! This is what I don't like about you. You are so tanky. Like, you can be fast and tanky and because you're crawling. Come here. Since you insist on being being a jerk and, and not and you know, using my using my doors for not their intended purpose. I was really wanting this to be a you know like kind of a horde based garage, you know, but Oh. Can't have all the fun things in life. Go away, Bob. So we're gonna have to kind of wing it here on YouTube. Lovely. Go away, and Mikey. And as long as I keep the keep the dogs at bay, we should be perfectly fine. Take care of you. Yeah, these. Ow. I don't know. 
Oh no. Spider zombie wants to. Spider zombie's coming after me and he. He snuck up on me. Oh my. I'll try to take care of Curly at least. There we go. Oh, one bites dust. Uh, where are you at? Oh, you're at speed again. Yeah, the blunderbuss is just not cutting it for him. Oh, well, at least the crawlers are having... At least the crawlers aren't having too much of a time. Boop. So, like Steve said, no lift this plane of existence. Oh, no. We're starting to get to the point where we have the spider zombies just pop up. These be dogs. There you go, Bob. Now we got Decayed Mother, aka Annie. Oh no. Come here. There you go. <sighs> Impromptu horde night, uh, run, uh, running horde night in the middle of the road. Ah. My favorite. Oh no, I'm going to die. Oh, darn it. <sighs> well, sorry about that. Sorry about that, YouTube. I'm not stopping it. It's like, I, you know, I've tried not to die. It's just like, you know, I'm like, oh, this went, this went a little sour. Okay. Thing is, on last work night, I did pretty decent. Well, the zombies died out, so we can at least try to take out more, more of these guys, so. Makes it easy for me to at least get my stuff on. Ow. No, 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 no. Ah. Well, I'm dying again. Yep. Well, that was, that was really dumb of me. <laughs> ah. What I should do is just, I should just run over for my backpack and just run over for my backpack and grab my stuff, get back in the base. That's really what I should do here at YouTube, but... <laughs> uh, gotta think about this. At least I invested into health net a little bit for, for the sake of uh, having some health on me. Alright. Grab, and we... And then we just uh, try and run in and... Nope. Get off. Uh, let me just run up here and grab my... Put my armor up, YouTube. There we go. Now we're somewhat safe from them. Well, well that works too. Alright. Armor... Almost done there, and weapons. Come on, come on up. We'll just take care of uh, Annie down here. Come on, since he insists. We'll actually run out the other side of the garage here. Crawler's one to run through as well, so. Well, two, unex <laughs> two unexpected deaths because I had an oversight in my... Oh boy. Well, thank goodness I didn't reel, didn't start reloading the blunder blunderbuss. So, come here. All right. I need to heal up really quickly. So, trying to hold off on the SMG a little bit. Kind of like a kayak. I like to consider the SMG the premium and stuff here. Come here. And I think that's Bob done. Shoot him in the butt. Yeah, he'll drag it. It is a little. It's a. It is a little unfortunate. Yeah, YouTube though. Um, I do stream this on Twitch. Yo, if you do want to watch us live, yo, be sure you come over and. Do it on Twitch, yo. You'll see a link in the description. In the description. 
it, I always uh, have uh, my little mascot, Davy Boy, uh, tell you at the beginning of every video. It's like, it's the place to go if you want to watch live and interact with me live. Um. So yeah, this this base has a has a little bit of modification to do. I I wish uh, I wish I knew this before I put the I put the uh, before I put these in and upgraded them with Forge Iron or anything. Because now I gotta tear them all down after Horde Night. Once I come back from Cup City, which. In case you're wondering, no, because of these deaths, I am not stopping my trip to Hub City. It's like, this can be done later in the next week. Level 98, um... The, um, the Spire Zombies want to... Just want to continue to, uh... Continue to keep their heads stuck in a, in a door. Oh! Bye, Chris. Do, 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 do. My key. There you go. Did I ever? Did that crawler ever get out of here? Don't remember. Oh, poor crawler. I think that's him. There we go. Alrighty. Um. Yeah, and then we got. Then we got. Well, that's actually not too bad, actually. I, I would have gotten that dug out and everything and put the foundation in, but I mean, if zombies want to do some, if zombies want to do some construction for me, then well, do some groundwork for me, then I'll I don't care. Like, hey, you can. Zombies don't really like the ground too much. Sometimes they get they get stuck in it. And it's, I just kind of like, hey, if you want to do a little digging for me and they're a spider zombie, then I'll. I'll let you have uh, all the... You can at least do something for me. Ow. Ah. Uh, yeah, it... I mean, they, they managed to dig out one block, so... One less block I have to use with use the steel shovel on. So, hey! <laughs> there's the... There's, we may have downsides, but we have upsides. May not be the best at their job, but... Hey. Oh. Chris is gonna run after me with one, with one arm. The one arm man who wants to run at me. Oh, no, no, no. Yep. Ah. Ow. Fire. Oh boy. I'm taking some damage. Yeah, we got about two hours left in Horde Night, though, folks. It's we'll just grab the first aid kit again. Thankfully, I have do I do have some first aid and on me in the well and the and in the house. So let's just see here. Spider's arm. Did you finally get out of the pit and decide to stop doing foundation work for me? You rather me pay? Well, I'm sorry, I don't have that much for you. I don't have much in flesh. Oh boy. Hi! You can you can taste the shotgun, please. There you go. Ha! Zombies, they love running at me. Oh, well, at least the crawler's still doing some work. I can't blame him. Nope. Get off. Now I'm blinded by fire. I can't believe I'm blinded by fire. Oh no, I'm dying. Nope, no, 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 nope. Go away. Nope. <laughs> we are on three hit points. Oh no. Uh, we'll just... Take another med kit really quickly, just so we can at least have a little bit pumped into me. I'm not even mad that they're beating on the garage doors anymore. Labor. 
what they can pay for me in labor is is their life. Their undead life. I will take it. Would have been nice if I took some beer with me too. This whole horde night just got awry. Come here. There you go. Blunderbuss is free. There you go. <laughs> Alright. Psycho Steve. Ow. Nope. Nope, no, no, no. That's a no for you. You may you may not smack me in the face. Ha ah. Chris, no, I I told you before you don't need to come over and smack me. Um We got curly run at me. Chris again wants to thinks he needs to come back for round two. Let's actually pull out the SMG a little bit. Go away. There we go. Alright. Offering a offering a deal on nine millimeter, you get a whole bunch. There you go. Leveling up a rifle is a little bit, but, okay. Only got less than half an hour till morning time, and then this madness can stop. Would you like to, uh, would you like to please, uh, uh, get out, <laughs> get out of there. Level 99, we got 27 skill points to spend. We'll take care of you. Shotgun's level 65. And then we got you. At least try to stun him a little bit. Ah. Oh no. Oh. And you wonder why I like the SMG so much. The SMG is a a very versatile tool to me. It's like on this version of Seven Days, it is. I love this thing so much because it gives me a... It gives me a reason... Well, it's like, it just stuns. Oh, only five minutes from, from the horde. Bob, no. Ah, so, even though we only had a couple deaths, you know... Horde night is over. Nope. Nope. No, please. You, I almost died again right after the horde bell, but... Oh, well. It's it's almost daytime and we got the crawler. Actually, take since I have the since I kept the wrench on me. Well, at least well at least take a look at it. Go away. We'll just clear out the zombies in a second though. That garage door was the most attacked out of the bunch. You're done. Oh. You guys got a couple blocks done, which you know, I appreciate your services, but we don't need you. We we don't need your services anymore. I can get this done a lot faster. There we go. Crawler's done. Um, did I hear? Oh, another one of you. You guys just hide in the reeds. Let's try not to. There's even more. <laughs> Crawler's there. Okay, you took out one of my rebar. All your work for the dirt blocks, that... Guys, you really need to... You really need to learn how to kind of keep on... You need to learn how to and not do business expenses. Yo. I appreciate the business, but it's time for you to go. There we go. Crawler lost his head. I know there was one more zombie having a time. Yeah, it's just Marla. Alright. But while we... Uh, uh, while I run over here really quickly just to check the damage out on this... Um... You actually... Oh, wow, they actually took out one phase of the door. They're only 1,200. But yeah, got some stuff to iron out over the next week, guys. So, I'm gonna end this episode here, YouTube. So... I thank you all for watching, and I hope you take care. Have a great day.